Hello guys and welcome to another video. In this video we are going to see how to connect two external monitors to MacBook Air M2 2022. In my previous video I showed you how to connect Windows laptop to two monitors. Like you can see the Windows laptop is connected to two monitors. But when I tried to connect MacBook M2 2022 the monitors gave no signal. I have figured it out what was the problem and now both the monitors are going to work. So let's begin the procedure from start and let's see how to connect MacBook Air M2 the latest model to two external monitors. So I am putting the link of my previous video where I connected this Windows laptop to these two monitors you, you can check it out there so first of all you need a docking station <coughs> uh, which should support display link so here you can see display link 4k plug and display so the docking station you are going to buy make sure that it supports display link and i bought a lenovo thinkpad hybrid usb c to usb a docking station you can see unboxing in my previous video, writing the link in the description. And you can see it supports display link. And now you need to install display link manager software. So I go to Safari. And just light it here download display link for mac so here you can see download display link for mac and then i go to this website display link mac os so display link manager graphics connectivity download accept and it start to download here so I open this one and do the installation continue continue agree install use password So it's installed now. Move to bin. So here you can see the icon for display link. And if I press press here, so you can see please allow screen recording permission. And it's a very important step which I missed in my last video and therefore I was unable to connect uh, two monitors. So you go to launch pad and then system preferences and here you go to security and privacy and then just go down here to screen recording and here you can see it's not this box is not checked in so you must check in this box and allow the display link manager so I open this one use password and just take this box quit and reopen so like that and then I close the settings so now you can see you can select a lot of options here So let's connect this MacBook to docking station and see it works or not. So here is my docking station from ThinkPad and the first step is I am going to connect this USB-C cable. One point goes to the laptop and the other to the docking station and you can see there is a USB-C port here but I am not going to insert this cable here. 
here you can see a USB port and you can see a laptop sign symbol so this port is going to power up your laptop so one end goes here and the other end goes to the laptop so now just insert the HDMI cable from the two monitors in the HDMI port so here are two HDMI ports so one goes here the second so it's connected by two HDMI ports the USB-C cable and then the power cable So you can see all the three screens are working. If I close the lid, you can see both the monitors are working right now. So if we open Safari for example, here you can see I have opened Safari and open one more tab. So here the plus sign go here so the two tabs are open so I can move one tab here you can see like that and if I open YouTube so you can see both the screens I, I have played YouTube on both of the screens and you can see different matches going on So on the one screen you can work one thing and the other screen you can work some other thing. An advantage of two screens. So if you go to the setting system preferences and go to displays. So here you can see my three screens and in the display settings. You can change the settings as well. So these two external monitors are working as extended display and this MacBook Air is the main display but you can change it whatever you want. And then if you go here so you can rearrange the screens like that so you can test a lot of things here so if your cursor is not moving between the screens then try to rearrange the monitors or screens so here you can see my display settings I have arranged my screens in this position these are two monitors and this one is laptop and if I go to display settings then the MacBook is my main display so you can change it here as well you can use as mirror for these monitors brightness and other stuff you can change then I have my external monitor as an extended display so you can change it to mirror as well this one is also an extended display so these are the settings I am using right now. Might be I can change them as well. So what happens if I go to display and change the first monitor from extended display to mirror for built-in liquidity now. So you can see. But I don't want this, so I just change stop mirroring. And I'm going to use this as an extended display. So here you can see all the three screens are working and you can see different stuff on different screens. 
on the MacBook Air. It's football going on. Here you can see some nature. Here are like animals. So all the three screens are working and the cursor is moving along all the three screens. So everything is working. The only thing I did was I bought a docking station which should support display link and then just connected the docking station through HDMI cables and installed the display link manager software in the MacBook and allow it screen recording and everything is working. Thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe my channel.